So if your Pinterest likes look like this, then that means you might have a problem. And that is okay, because I have a problem too. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you doing today? You look great as usual, okay? Oh my gosh, like, I can't believe you're looking this good and I'm looking a mess. Like, stop, stop stunning on me, okay? Stop making me look bad. But anywho, how are you guys doing? Great, that's great. So you're probably wondering, Jasmine, what are you doing? Like, why do you have Pinterest open? What's going on? What's tea, this ain't Bloxburg? I know, okay, I told you guys today's video is gonna be a little bit different. I'm trying something different, trying something new. And I think it'll be fun, okay? And it's still kind of Blossberg related, so you know, you, you, you know, we're getting, we're being experimental, okay? So pretty much, I'm gonna show you guys a really cool way that I get my home ideas and kind of how I build my houses, like an easy way, like it's kind of like a map in a way, or just like an inspiration board. It, it's a mood board, okay? I don't know why I just did all that. It's a mood board, and I'm about to show you how you can use it to build a house, okay? So we're kind of gonna build a house on a collage. We're gonna build a house on paper. I don't know how to explain this, okay? But you guys are gonna see. So I have my collage maker open right here. I use Be Funky, as you guys can probably see at the top of the screen. And we're gonna use that. And I also have my Pinterest open. So let me just show you what I'm talking about and kind of, you know, let's talk about some homes okay so right now i have my pinterest likes open as you can see it is mostly homes okay like it's mostly homes um in my pinterest likes like this describes my life this is what i do literally every single day i'm just house obsessed and i'm going to show you what how i use this to build my homes on blocksburg sims um in real life how i take inspiration i'm going to show you guys how to do that and first what i like to start off with is the exterior of the house but I, I usually scroll through pinterest look look through my likes and i see what exterior of the home i like or what exterior looks cool and then i'll pick that i pick that first because you need the outside of the house first before you can do the inside so i kind of just scroll through and there was one house that i really really liked that I seen earlier that I wanted to use for this video. And let me see if I can find it. Okay, y'all, the amount of scrolling I just did was ridiculous. <laughs> like I have so many things in my likes, it's crazy. Okay, so we're gonna go with this house. This is the house that I seen earlier that I really, really liked. And I'm just gonna go ahead and save this. I'm gonna save it to my downloads. And then I'm going to open my collage maker. Go to image right here, go to computer, click on the house, upload it, drag it, and drop it. And now I have my exterior of how I want the house that I'm building or whatever to look. So this is the outside. This is how the outside is gonna look. And this is what I'm gonna model my Bloxburg build or whatever after is this, uh, is this house. So then I move on and I start doing the inside. So I look for a picture of how I want the inside to look. And then once we're all done putting all the pictures here, we're gonna have the um, foyer, we're gonna have the bathroom, the kitchen, the living room, all that. And then I can save it, look at it on my phone. So when I'm building, I'm like, okay, this is how I know how this is gonna look. You know, and it kind of just goes from there. I have my inspiration from there. So yes, we have the exterior here. Now let's do the or oh, we can do the kitchen so I have like tons of kitchens on here. I don't know, I'm kind of feeling this kitchen because you guys know how I, you guys know that I love the two-story kitchens, okay, with the balcony, on looking the kitchen, I love it. I love it, so I think I might go with this one. I really like how this one looks, but let, let's look at some more. See our other options. Um, See, I have so many kitchens on here, it's crazy. Like, this one looks really nice. I like how this one looks. This one looks nice, but not really for that house. Let me go to another one. Kitchens are my favorite part, but they're also like really difficult because there are so many kitchens that you can do, it's crazy. Like, it's really hard to pick one. Really do like this one. Really like the way this kitchen looks because I love the black island here but with the white cabinets. I like the contrast of it with the dark floor and the like yellowish type of walls. Really like that contrast. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and save this one cause I think I really like the way that one looks. So let me go back to my collage maker. 
I'm gonna upload both of the pictures that I just saved. Um, Cause sometimes you can mix and match them. Like you can mix them like, okay, you might like this dark kitchen, but you want the kitchen to have that on looking balcony. So you can kind of like do this here, do the kitchen, but you know for sure that you probably want this kitchen to have this like type of balcony. So you can just like put that right here at the bottom. Like, okay, it's gonna be this kitchen, but it's gonna have this type of balcony. Cause I think this looks really cool, Um, but we'll see, we'll see. So now we can move on. We can look at the foyer and see how we want our foyer to look. I think I have plenty of photos of foyers in my Pinterest likes. So let's see. Okay, see now I like this kitchen. See, see. <laughs> that's what the see like it, it's hard okay like my pinterest likes be going off I, I have some good pins and my likes now see here we go with the balcony kitchen like look at this kitchen look at the kit like mm. see i'm gonna have to do another one of these videos okay because i'm i'm seeing a whole bunch of stuff i like seeing a whole bunch of stuff i like but it's not matching with that home that i got that home i kind of wanted to be like a i don't know i'm kind of going for your typical suburban home I'm, i think i'm going for that look so let's see, let's see. I mean, this looks pretty nice. This is like pretty much the type of living room I always do. Like I have the two shelves, the floor to ceiling fireplace. Like this is like the living room I do all the time. I know we were supposed to be doing a foyer, but I really like this as a bathroom. So I'm gonna save it. This is kitchen heaven. Like this is just like the amount of beautiful kitchens I'm looking at right now is ridiculous. Okay, I really like this mountain home style. I really like this, but hmm. Wood cabinets just have a special place in my heart. Okay, I actually really like this. I think I like this better than the kitchen I had picked. So can, can I save it? Okay, I ended up replacing that kitchen because I like the way this one looks. <laughs> I really like the way this one looks. So I guess we're going for a mountain, uh, mountain home style. See, now that we have that, I can really cut up, okay? For some reason, this is very intriguing as a bedroom. Very intriguing. Like this little balcony at the top, really cool. Really cool, and I think I like it, and I want it. We're not on bathrooms yet, but I really like this bathroom, so saving it. Another bathroom I like, saving it. We pretty much have our living room aesthetic, but I really like this, so I'm gonna save this anyways. So let's go see what we have going on. Okay, so I have the pictures I kind of want uploaded, so let me just put them together and see how all this turns out. Okay, we have a living room right here. Let's put a bathroom right here. We have the bathroom right there, and all I need is a nice foyer. That's all I need, and I wanna add that right here. Okay, I think I found a foyer that looks pretty appropriate that would probably go. I actually have one already. I just didn't know if I liked it, but let's see how it looks. Just fit it on right here. It fits perfectly. Move it to the side a little bit. Okay, and there we have it. There we have our house complete. So now when I go into Blacksburg, I know how I want the outside to look. I have an idea of how I want the living room and the kitchen to look. More of the living room, the foyer, and like a bathroom. So I kind of overall got the look of the house. And as far as the bedrooms and things like that, I kind of go based off who I want the bedroom to be for, whether that be a teenage girl or a toddler son or you know your granny like whoever I kind of just go based off that and then I'll search like you know teenage boy bedrooms or um bachelor bedrooms or um grandparent bedrooms and I kind of go off that but as far as like the premise or pretty much um overall how I want the house to look this is like what I would do before I even start building on Blocksburg I do this all the time and this is how I get my house inspiration this is what I do. This is how I make my houses look realistic because I pretty much have a um, map of how I want it to look. I pretty much have a mood board and a plan of what I'm doing before I even go into there. I never just jump in there and just start building. I always have a map or a plan of how I want it to look in my head, especially when I'm decorating, when I'm doing a speed build. Um, it's, even with the houses that I'm working on right now that you guys seen yesterday, like the floor plans and the kitchens and stuff, I did this. And I have like a little collage for each house of how I want it to look. So this is a great way to um, get started with building. This is a great way to um, see what you're doing. If something you don't like, you know, if it's not working out, take one out put another one in and kind of see how it matches so you can see the vibe of your house so it all correlates um, before you even start building. So I hope this helped you guys. Um, I feel like this is gonna be, this was a short video. Um, I don't know if it's short or not. 
I don't know. I have to edit it and see, but I feel like it was short because I don't feel like I was sitting here talking that long. But I hope this helped you guys. Um, I hope you try to do it. It's really fun. I do this even when I'm not building. I just do it like in my free time because I don't have any friends and I don't have a life and I'm single. So I just sit here and do this. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you found it helpful, please leave a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, okay? Because we do videos like this all the time. And if you like videos like these, let me know because I can definitely do more. I wanted to do more of these in this video, but I didn't know if you guys would like it or not. I'm kind of just testing the waters. Um, so yeah, let me know how you feel about this. Let me know if this helped you. And if you make one on your own, please send it to me i want to see it okay join my discord the link is in the description send me your home collage see if you can build it on blocksburg please let me know i want to see it and yeah i will see you guys in my next video bye